Hi, my people, viewers and subscribers. Waiting, I see shock me. And some of you who have seen this video that I'll be showing you, I know say it shock you as well. Chai! You see the people where they pilot the affairs of Nigerians. You see this political class that are in authority. You see this elite class for Niger. You know go better for Una. I swear. You know go better for Una. Chai! In fact, make I no talk too much. Make Una take Una eyes. See, wait I see. How much is for feeding per day, for instance? As at now? Yeah. For the recruits? Yeah. For 150 naira. Per day? Per day. That's a 50 naira per meal. It's too mega. <laughs> 150 naira for a day may sound unbelievable, but unfortunately, it is true. The call for lunch on a typical day. After the queue for their ration, this is what 50 recruits get to share. It is difficult to describe what you see in the police training school in Kaja, where you have cesspools next to kitchen. All sorts of terrible things are going on there. And the public is not aware of it. Many of them have abandoned the dining hall. After all, it is too small to accommodate all of them. But the act almost got them into trouble on one of the days our crew visited. Allows that you will not be using the dining to eat. That somebody said. Madam said nobody should use the dining. Who is the person that that instruction was given to? Let me see you now. The headmaster has told you, if you are caught eating outside, you're on your own. Here, I am the man. Here, this message. This message. For a healthy young man required to have the energy to survive the intensive training of a law enforcement officer, it is ridiculous to expect him to feed on 150 naira per day. Although they weren't permitted to speak to us on camera, during our interaction with them, we found out how they survive, albeit illegally. If we expect anything good from the police, we must at least, you know, Give to, give them something in return. You know, the way things are now is like you are expecting something from nothing. You know, this is next to impossible. You know, for a man that has not been taken care of at all to come and protect you is not possible. Many bulk at their murder. Police is your friend. Why they cannot be blamed because of their experience with the officers of the Nigerian police. To change this trend, something has to be done. The earlier, the better for everyone. Ayola Kasim reporting for Channels Television News. Una Siam, you shock you, Abby. You believe this kind of thing, they happen? Now you are now understanding. When I say that Nigeria is a crime against humanity and that Nigerians are victims of Nigeria, now you will get to understand that even those in uniform are the bigger victims of our society. 
many of the politi many of the politicians that you see today parading themselves as your leaders are walking demons blood thirsty demons from what you have seen these guys they make budget fat budget for these police training colleges and at the end of the day they get mind make a budget bringing down the feeding of a trainee or an intending police officer under training 50 naira per meal 50 naira per meal no wonder when you see them acting in this manner you understand that these guys are mentally disordered they are mentally traumatized how can you pass through this process and still be behaving like a normal human being no tell me now you understand it is not even their fault it starts from their training they are trained not to see human being like proper human being they are trained like animals because that is what the political class sees the ordinary nigerians they don't care about you you are either there or there here the political class and the ally squad and the poor masses including you men of the uniform after traumatizing you they arm you with 8k 47 what do you expect my people they go out there and start hunting you like animal games in the world you see why this end sucks come up no wonder god chose this path to open up the floodgate for the revolution in nigeria but we must not relent we must not give up desensitization will continue we must channel this energy we must get to our men in uniform because they are even the greater victims because they are the ones being used to run down this freedom tested or aspired by the nigerian people because we have really understood the powers we have but we have seen how they've used violence they introduced violence through the talks and when that one is not working effectively they brought in men of the uniform and you see the spillover thank god we the protesters withdrew and rioters that the political class introduced took over the day but when they finish we'll come back that's nebulu nazu or biogo we are in to restructurize so that they will not have any ground to undermine the freedom of nigerian people from the shackles of their wickedness and oppression you have a role to play first to keep sharing every single content from this platform because faith comes from hearing but how would they have faith when they have not heard and how would they hear if you have not shared this video please keep sharing let the nigerian people especially those in uniform go and you know start organizing themselves and start protesting from within their institutions why are you not being paid properly why are your allowances denied why is it that money meant for your equipment to fight insurgent corruption and insecurity in nigeria you're not getting it you're not getting the equipment whereas the budget has been made but some people cannot it this is time for you to be patriotic which is supposed to lie on the side of the nigerian people and not the political class in power who ultimately have made you victims of the system so get this video round let everybody get to see this and we must channel this energy to achieve a total overhaul of the system politically we must 
flush this political class out. We can do this only through two ways. Either through unrest by taking up arms or through political process by taking up your BVC. And I must say this. We will channel our campaign, our next protest to INEC because they are the instrument being used against the people. And I must say this very briefly before I round up. We go to the banks, open account, and you are offered your ATM on the spot. What stops INEC from issuing voters card to the people on the spot? That is part of the failure of the system. They want many people, many Nigerians not to participate in political process so that they will be able to maneuver the small number of people that are, you know, they are being used to keep their wickedness, you know, running. But we must end this. That is why every Nigerian youth must get involved, beginning from myself. We must join this new political movement that is you know being mobilized the nigerian youth it is time to make that change i'm signing out if you are new on this platform welcome on board like share subscribe and click on the notification bell for more videos stay safe goodbye <music>